parents are tracking instances of violence and safety concerns at various Baltimore County Public Schools. WMER 2 News' Dave Detling takes a look at some of these cases. He's in Essex, where school staff found a loaded gun. Well, parents tell me they are disgusted about all this violence, including that loaded gun that was found behind me at Chesapeake High School inside a classroom, and they're calling for change. I imagine you want answers as to who it belonged to, what's the update with absolutely, police. Absolutely, absolutely. So, I mean, like, because it was just left there, they got to do a lot of research to find, you know, to trace it back. Families at Chesapeake High School are concerned after staff members found a loaded gun and ammunition inside a bag. It was reportedly left inside a classroom yesterday. The intentions of it, was it, I mean, was the child intending to hurt somebody or was it just intended to scare somebody? It's unclear who the weapon belongs to, but Baltimore County police are investigating. Tiffany Johnson picked up family members early because they didn't feel safe. They have the incident on the news, but they didn't even talk to the children about what transpired yesterday. So naturally, these kids are unknown to what's going on and they're petrified. So like aunts, we went and got the kids because they don't want to be in there. They're scared. But I, at the end of the day, it has to stop. These kids don't deserve that. They deserve better. The loaded gun is not the only safety concern. Earlier this week at Dundalk Middle School, there was a fight involving students and parents jumped in. Tina's daughter witnessed the fight and immediately picked up the phone. I was at work, so I asked my daughter if she was all right. What, what could I do for her? You know, and then she said, Mom, I'll be okay. Boy. Hey! All right, come on now. There was also this fight near the school grounds of Dundalk High School. The fight between students was over a stolen motorized scooter. In this case, no one was arrested or charged. School's only been in session for over three weeks. We are here about the shooting in Towson. We hear about the loaded handgun in Chesapeake High School. We see fights on social media. Darren Badillo, who's planning a run for county office, is also part of the Baltimore County Parents and Student Coalition. He says parents need to band together and speak up. It is very scary right now, and we have a lot of concerned parents and a lot of concerned kids. At schools Thursday, there was additional police presence. We know BCPS has sent out letters, but parents tell me the district needs to do more. And if you have any information about any of these cases, Baltimore County Police want to hear from you. Reporting outside Chesapeake High School, Dave Detling, WMAR 2 News.